As the refugee crisis in Europe worsens, this winter, Awaz FM Community Radio organised a delivery of warm clothes and took it to the so-called jungle. The response from our listeners was overwhelming. Calais' largest camp, also known as the jungle, is home to hundreds of people who have fled war, persecution and poverty. Many of the refugees live in makeshift shelters and a lucky few in a derelict sports hall. There is no clean water and no sanitation. It is staggering to think that such a place can exist in Northern Europe. The destitution of people trying to survive, the level of poverty, squalor and unbelievable conditions that people are trying to live in. When you see human excrements all over the place and the health risk, you feel the degree of desperation of the people living there and the refugee state within a state. The lack of responsibility, whether by the governments or local authorities, mean this reality is actually an act of barbarism. Thousands remain displaced and the situation is not sustainable. Most of them want to reach the UK. In order to do this, they have to see a smuggler. These people control certain areas like petrol stations. Some die along the route. The Calais authorities do not record the death of migrants who die whilst trying. Can you imagine what it feels like to give up everything you've got to come to a camp that you've never been to before and not know how you're going to survive? There is no us in them. There is only us. This is a lost generation that wants help to rebuild their country. They are fighting to keep their dreams. They have one target, one hope, to feel safe. Our work does not stop until the crisis stops. And your help today helps us to help there tomorrow.